Gizmo will always make time for you. Says you should team up and take over the world or what? Says you should... Gizmo will always make time. There it is, the tree of life. The idea that all life is related by common descent. Where the twigs are existing species and those produced in the past represent the succession of the extinct. The tree's great branches were once budding twigs, a connection between the past, present and future. A representation of all extinct and living species with its ever-branching and beautiful ramifications. We are an evolution of those that came before. The Yerp Fields, where the echo of your actions resounds clearer than any other place you'll find, except for where that's not true. It's a place well hidden. It's just below the above. This place is like one big secret that keeps unfolding. Out of date's impressed you made it this far, but there's still so much left to do. The end of the world is still on everyone's minds. You've beaten a path where you have the power to destroy or save everyone. Question is, what you'll do with that responsibility? He worries about you. If you love yourself, you don't hurt others. But the more you hate yourself, the more you want others to suffer. Thinks it's important that you remember who you are and where you came from. Someone without knowledge of their history and origin is like a tree without roots. He promises he'll be there for you. Just come talk to him beneath the tree if you're feeling lost. Out of date says there's a time for everything. And now there's no use thinking of the past, for it's gone. Think of the present because that's where you are. It's time to set your priorities as the one who completes things. He's worried that you're putting the world at risk. But darkness isn't necessarily the end of the world. It's just another perspective. If the world really does end, there won't be anywhere to... Two sides to everything, but for him it would be devastating if you were forced to use the Ark to escape while the world crumbled. Out of date says there's no clear record of the chain of events that changed the course of history and brought the world to its knees. He's found evidence on the Ark, records of a crisis, decades of contamination that permeated the ground and broke its inner core. The contamination disrupted what we now know as key energy, the life force that runs through all things, living and inanimate. He's been told the blight affected everything at a genetic level and turned our perception of normality on its head. It was only those that changed that avoided extinction, proving that the possibility for survival and renewal was real. He understands you are curious about the ship at the foot of the tree. He says it surfaced when the oil broke through the ground. The Ark predates the back-in days, and now, after years of study of the manuals he found inside, 
He believes he's figured the ship out. Mau Mauya Fabube Muk Kufar. The Ark has room for four more, even if you think no one else is worth saving if the world comes to an end. Paiketawa Fabube Muk Kufar. He'll keep the seats open, and you are free to invite up to four others to join you in the Ark in the event of a cataclysm. Out of date says that from what he's heard, you've been busy. He says he appreciates what you've done so far, but unfortunately he's got urgent news from his friend Goop in the southeast. Out of date says he knows you're good hearted enough to do your best to support Goop. He says he'll point you in the right direction, but finding Goop and making sure he gets what he needs is up to you. That's the sound of impending doom. Out of date's premonitions of imminent disaster are true. The porky puff needs to be handled. Out of date says that Goop is worried now that the Southeast World Eater is stepping up its activity. Come, Weepa. Wherefore, where, where? He explains that Goop is working on a goo gliding vessel in order to get to the World Eater, but needs help to get it done. Mpa, wherefore, where we? Ewe, bobuye. Out of date suggests that you should head southeast as fast as possible and see what you can do to help. Tuluaba. He wonders what's on your mind. Understands completely. Out of date says the time has come for you to reconcile with your past. Lupa Lupin is still staying in the camp where he was brought up. He hopes you'll find the answers you are looking for there. It's in your nature to hope for the best but prepare for the worst, but it's likely a meeting with the Lupin will end in confrontation. He'll point you in the right direction, but the rest is up to you. This part of the journey is one you'll have to do on your own. Lupa Lupin's camp has always been there, hidden deep inside the mountains. Out of date hopes you'll find your way and the answers you were looking for once you're there. He knows he said it before, but the time has come to put an end to the Lupin's reign of terror. You should get over there, come face to face with destiny. It's going to be you against the Lupin. No rules. He's happy to help. Says goodbye to you. Lupa Lupin's camp has always been there, hidden deep inside the mountains.
Super Lupin says he's been looking <laughs> for you this moment. He wanted you to come here and see for yourself where it all started. He was so little when your mother and kin came here to put an end to his mother just because she was different, a hunter. That night, the hunter became the hunted, trapped with nowhere to run. He says your mother showed no mercy, only vengeance. He can see that you're like your mother. You would have made the same decision and taken the same action she did. You're a killer too. They orphaned him, left him alone, an outcast and a freak. Lupa Lupin says he's been reliving the moment every night since then. He says your mother and her disciples started something that couldn't be undone. They created the monster he would become. He knew his time would come and he was patient. So, when he got news about your birth, he knew how to get revenge that would last. That's why he spared you that night he raised the village when you were a child. He wanted you to suffer for life, like he had. He marked you for life, so he'd recognize you when you met again, and you'd eventually remember where you came from. His hunger grew insatiable over the years to come. He tried, but being vegetarian wasn't in his nature and he couldn't go hungry. But he's never taken a life for the sake of appetite. It's always been about survival, and that our true self is being who we are. No. A deep look into nature will make you understand everything better, and that natural selection eliminates, and the strongest survive. Fate is for those too weak to determine their own destiny, and now, the time has come for you to accept yours. in the face.
to why Impaso Dombupu Bukoye. Out of date says that from what he's heard, you've been busy. Kabobe Farhi, Kantita Dwela Bufo. He says he appreciates what you've done so far, but unfortunately he's got urgent news from his friend Noko in the east. Mauketo Tul Atu Iamangao. Out of date says he knows you're good hearted enough to do your best to support Noko. Ewe Bobuye, Mauketo. He says he'll point you in the right direction, but finding Noko and making sure she gets what she needs is up to you. That doesn't sound good. Out of date was spot on. The hoof puff needs to be stopped. Out of date says that Noko is worried now that the Eastern World Eater is stepping up its activity. He explains that Noko keeps a fabled steed that she has planned to ride out to the World Eater, but needs help to get it prepared. Out of date suggests that you should head east as fast as possible and see what you can do to help. He's happy to help. Hopes to see you again soon.